Hello world from whichever time zone you're catching me from. My name is MD90 and you're tuned in to Kutika. Pay attention. So Lusaka is regarded as the world world west when it comes to relationships. Like the, the last place you, you want to have a relationship in is Lusaka. What is wrong oh. with you? Tell us, Lusaka. Hmm? Ah, Tell us. Lusaka, eh? Lusaka, Lusaka. <laughs> Getting your um, You know, the, the level the, of promiscuity, that's what I'm getting to. Like I know, I know. That's the Lusaka. I get the wild, wild west the wild, 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 wild west <laughs> reference. Um I think I think this is um indicative of like the the cycle of society societal growth if you pay attention to the way societies evolve mm -hmm. you notice certain trends okay and if you look at a country you can see these trends happening in real time in different places okay so if you travel for example to um to any uh, rural area especially like the most remote ones, mm -hmm. you will notice the simplicity of life there. Yeah. Right? But there's certain things that are still fundamentally human. So Lusaka is, is very bad. But I refuse to believe that it's a unique sort of, um, you know, a dynamic. It's only happening here. But in Zambia it's only, will happen here you know, like, in like, the global context. I think, I think on, a, on, a, on a global scale, mm. you know, because even in rural areas, there's a lot of promiscuity. The only difference is it's in so Osaka, it's publicized. See, anything that happens here is easy to be seen by oh, everyone. Yeah. So even if people in a rural area are, you know, cheating more than people are here, mm. people here are more likely to see that that happening. Yeah. You know, because first of all, there's there's social media. Okay. And secondly, there's the social media. But then again, there's this argument. This is from my own observation. Um, right. The level of promiscuity between Copper Belt and Lusaka is different. Right. This is what this is what I, I found out personally. Right. Uh, on the Copper Belt, marriage is like a big deal. Like um, people get married at a very young age. Yes. That's a fact. I've got cousins that are married. I'm like, yo, I'm 10 years older than you, youngster. What, what, what the hell are you doing in the marriage? Such <laughs> a <you> marrying, huh? <laughs> but that, that, that's one thing I've observed from the Copper Belt is that for Lusaka, is that we went to, to get to a certain uh, financial stability for you, right. for a guy to say, okay, right. nah, I'm good enough to, to to shut down the system. I'm sign off. I'm, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. out of the streets. I'm, I'm, I'm out. Yes, but on the go belt, you find that even someone, their financial standing is not all all, all out there or right. well balanced. Right. But they they do get in the in the marriage. But then again, this is where it comes critical with the couple belt. The couple belt is that usually they do get in the marriage and then become promiscuous in that marriage. So you find that no, so you find that within okay. the same community, um. they, they, they are pretty much sharing each other in that community. But Lusaka, Lusaka they do that stock exchange. Literally. But the Lusaka, they do it uh, prior to, to marriage. In as much as yes, even after marriage, the guys right. still, right. they still swing. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But that, that, those, those are differences with the couple okay. So what, what would you attribute that that difference too, because these are fairly urban. Yeah, they are both urban areas. Yes. Um, but I think I think again when you look at when you look at society and its growth, the area that accommodates the most different people is more likely to have cultural dynamism. Mm -hmm. So the, the the culture of a Lusaka citizen or Lusaka dweller will not be the same as the culture of somebody from Kasama. At least like like on the base, mm. like by default. Because people that are more exposed to different cultures mm -hmm. tend to have their own culture diluted. Yes, yes, yes. Right? So, so the, then the culture that is prevailing in this yes, is, it's, is, it's is a, a blended it's a whole, one. Yes, yes, yes. So it's kind of, kind of similar with like languages. You know how, you know, because there's too many people here, the language we speak over time evolves to accommodate yes. different languages. Yes, yes. So then with the cultures um, and like morals and, and all these different things, it's the same thing. Mm -hmm. So Lusaka is like the heart of Zambia, mm -hmm. you know? Uh, and because it's the heart of Zambia, that's where everyone is. Comes in the... Exactly. So then you have a lot more different people here, a lot mm -hmm. more um, different things and a lot more different mindsets. Mm -hmm. And so it's very easy to adopt, you know, very un-Zambian even, 
you know uh cultures, cultures because yeah, we depends. we are exposed to them from here mm-hmm. more often than from other places yeah you know, so i think that's what would account for why there's a lot more you know promiscuity just, why, why are you trying to sugarcoat the no, no, I'm, not, I'm, not sugarcoat it. I'm trying i'm trying to i'm, I'm like, trying to no, i'm a church boy <laughs> you don't do uh, <laughs> i'm accommodating different like behavioral um traits you know traits yes within the same uh idea mm-hmm. because it's not just promiscuity there's a lot of things that are happening uh, more here than they are happening elsewhere yeah and because of that um cultural exchange that happens here more than it does in other places yeah. so i think yeah that's pretty much my take on it so what what did you advise someone that's coming out of town and they are looking to get into <laughs> <laughs> no, Dude, I'm going to I leave I'm I leave in Lusaka <laughs> okay there is still some good men in Lusaka so I think you're one of those I'm not saying anything about myself <laughs> I'm just Sit saying I'm, look there's, talk about there's, MDS, there's no relation there's they, no relation between the two sentences but mm-hmm. I live in Lusaka mm-hmm. and there's good men in Lusaka mm-hmm. okay yeah. but now, my point is there there is definitely a lot more bad ones than good ones but there is some good ones. So we are the bad ones that you are the... I'm not. No. Dude, do you think I'd be here with you if I knew for sure that you were a rotten ground nut? I'm not sure what you're talking about. Ask around. <laughs> I did no. But yeah, so um, it's 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 unfortunate but I think over time as societies grow we pick up these things. Yeah. And you get you can see these these cyclical kind of um, behavioral patterns over like when you look at different cultures you know even like asian cultures are becoming different now there's like they're picking up like the younger ones are picking mm-hmm. up traits of you know non asian sort of mm-hmm. you know people like there's all these So you're, you're blaming what is happening it's like on the diversity of the individuals it's it's one of the key um components that contribute to that So if 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 you are if I to what's the capital city of uh South Africa? is it Pretoria or it's Pretoria okay, right it's in Cape Town No I think it's Pretoria is okay. the capital but the uh, what uh, whatever it is Right the level of promiscuity in South Africa and Zambia which which, which is more promiscuous I either. I don't I don't know but I I would like to assume it's South Africa because South Africa is a lot more um exposed Let, and a lot more westernized than mm-hmm. than Zambia is Okay yeah Zimbabwe and Zambia Zim is Zim is not playing, my guy. Zim is just not playing. Even Bot is not playing. Yo, so, Botswana is can be attributed to the fact that at some point it had more women than than men. I remember that that was a fact. So Botswana is an exceptional case. But the Sahara is a, I mean, Zambia is a fair balance between men and uh, women. In as much as obviously women dominate everywhere else, they right. are the majority everywhere else. But the gaps not that much. So I think Lusaka's situation is just more publicized. It's not that bad, isn't it's, it? it? No. I it could it could be that bad. I I I don't have the statistical um, No, one has the trend. It's just give. an assumption. Everybody's just working on assumptions. No, no one really has this. Was <laughs> okay, so these guys went to the, these ladies came no, no one has that, those, those facts. It's it's much based on assumptions and um, what's what, what's what's going on. Find that no you, you think you are in a stable relationship with a lady and you know <laughs> I've got the Fifth wife. The next thing you find is you're like, no way. Your, your wife is trending online. Like, no, she's not the one. Yeah, <laughs> that's your wife trending on. So you you never know. No, But uh, we 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 can't we can't. Um, what, what's the word? We 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 can't, we can't we can't use one 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 term to we can't stereotype the right, intensity. Right. It's it's diverse. Yes, we've got those those cases uh, prevailing. Right. Just like we are anyway. I was just a little more. Yeah. Uh pronounced, isn't it? Yeah, it's true. So anyways, um so ladies and gentlemen, feel free to to date with Lil Osaka. I mean, you you give it a shot. You'll find the Osaka stock exchange <laughs> literally. <laughs> Now, but um yeah, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. If I must say. <laughs> All right. We'll be back. <laughs> okay, we'll be right back. <laughs>